We got Max. There are spoilers in this video. Yakuza Zero is a groundbreaking <laughs> business management and unhinged violence simulator. Violence. The player is tasked with the thorough exploration of people's faces using your fists. In Lovely. This oriental inspired entertainment product. It's up to you to beat dastardly criminals, lead <laughs> to death, manage the economy, manage. This women is a, as a game. Pimp, do the yoinky sploinky. Great the pizza what? to the illiterate, and so much more. <laughs> in the backdrop of a murder mystery crime drama incited by rampant real estate speculation, we play as. I've never played Yakuza. Kiryu Zabubafu and Goro Meningitis <laughs> as they prowl the streets of that weird city from Persona 5. That along weird the way, city. Doing an excess of justified self-defense mugging to spend their ill-gotten gains on increasingly odd behavior. I all love it. Oh yeah, isn't there like weird in-game cutscenes? Taking place within the Silly Spaghetti People Club. The with what? such esteemed members as the entire cast of Goodfellas and uh -huh. a Sundowner from the Metal Goose series. Of course, Innocence goose. will be caught in the crossfire. It's an inclusive game. But whether I'm on the stage, on getting Elden Ring. Hell yeah. in the plot, performing gentrification, or just watching literal in-game pornography, I was nice. always held at the edge of my seat, wondering what could possibly come next. So despite I, the darkness how do you top this? certain murder, it maintains a tonal dissonance I can only describe as neck-shattering in a way that uh -huh. is always a breath of fresh air. With all this said Definitely and done, I invite you air. to enjoy the bizarre world of Yakuza Zero and the thrilling experience of its dimensional karaoke. I hear the karaoke is amazing. <laughs> I love this. This is a wild experience, it looks like. I love it. This music is based. I there love is no it. better place to start than with the various methods we employ to atomize My people into the base That's weird. I didn't know that. Gotcha. Two characters and eight unique fighting styles. There uh -huh. is always variation. And for the blind people in my audience, uh -huh. Yakuza is a beat 'em up in the most literal sense. We should have talked about how they have to look at Braille. Mongolian horse. You have to see strange <laughs> characters such as goons, <laughs> bikers, your own Yakuza, uh -huh. men in black, and uh, Chinese oh, men. Don't worry. Chinese These delicate men. hands would never kill anyone unless they don't subscribe. Or Ring that like button, smash the bell. We attack using a flurry of different intricate combos to build our primordial rage meter, which we use to cause rage the real meter. damage in the form of hundreds emotional of emotional damage. Animations ranging from light jabs to does eat the legend. Certain Absolute death. legend. The beauty in all of this is that, like the beautiful and respectable sounding Japanese language, expression <laughs> of our death resource is context sensitive. Uh -huh. with possibly hundreds of different. Wait, what was that chart? <laughs> expression of our death resource is context. Yeah, uh... Wait, what the fuck does this even mean? Okasa... Yeah, I mean, this is all just familial. Jap oh, it's unique suffix. Like, I thought that said sex for some reason. Sensitive, with okay. possibly hundreds of different, entirely unique secret, how, how secret Korean? Never-ending war on bones. Are Bo you carrying a giant <laughs> cone? That's an animation. Are you near a ledge on this one level? Well, not to worry. Or maybe you just have a box. Serve right. that shit up faster than FedEx. Every wow. single takedown is this gratuitously violent. But don't worry, neither of our characters canonically kill anyone. We just give them lifelong <laughs> disabilities that are... Worse than death, since yeah. I'm feeling generous. Let's talk about exactly how. Playing as Kiryu Kazu, our fighting style Kazoo. consists of the brawler. A I'm sorry, did you just pick up the fucking thing? Focused on replicating the police experience. Rush hour, a quick attacking and dodge moveset well suited to cowards. And monkey mode, which instantly adds several <laughs> hundred to pounds monkey. of muscle mass that you then have to drag around. It's not very good. I Switching love this. to our next character, Pirate Captain Goro Majima gives us the funky styles. As a thug, we have a wide Break range it down. of generic moves and Goro the style. Neck snapping power. Fucking I don't think hell. we're going to get back up. As a breakdancer, yes, a breakdancer, we sacrifice takedowns for style in the most absurd and I love this. way possible. I mean, how and do you fight slugger, that? You don't. We cheat by pulling out the fucking baseball bat and wielding <laughs> oh. nunchucks, letting us hit quite hard and exploit every boss in the game. He just can't uh, do anything. On top of this, there bat are two OP. secret fighting styles normally completely inaccessible to the player, and unfortunately, the process for their acquisition is very interesting. One might say <laughs> physically painful. As early as Chapter 7, you're given the business opportunity of establishing a whore monopoly, and Majima Amazing. takes it with great enthusiasm. To unlock the final fighting style, we will have to run our cabaret club well enough to I kind of need to play this. Prostitution daimyo of Japan. It'll be a fun <laughs> side quest. I told myself, just like Stop. Oblivion. That's oh. a fun game. 
It is a fun game, actually. When it doesn't there are hurt. Many ways to run a high society. As someone who's beaten it twice. Like abuse, but a true manager <laughs> of a great establishment has many factors to consider. Contrary to popular belief, all women are different. But like the caste system, all people Obviously. can be classified. Our objective is to keep the customer as happy as possible uh -huh. by balancing our women's specializations. Some girls are cute, <laughs> others are great at covers. I'm sorry, was that fucking Wadame and Rushi? Are you fucking me? Well, by balancing our women's specializations, some girls. <laughs> Even this far back, Max was like, Wadame, please, please collab with me. Girls are cute, others are it. great at conversation, and some are skilled. Skill. Akira has a degree in Skill. biomedical engineering. I Old love patrons it. Patrons like me have very <laughs> low expectations. Hello, you. Pleased with rubbing rocks together, while wealthy patrons have refined tastes like physical and mental abuse. Every yeah, employee absolutely. has their limits. And I didn't know how far back this rabbit hole went. As far as possible. <laughs> Truly, we are the Bezos of cabaret. Now, if yeah. you'll excuse me, I'll be attending the poor people hunt. Of course, <laughs> as a proper host, it's up to you to attend to every customer. Where uh -huh. Uh -huh. Things go from relaxing to batshit. Every uh -huh. time you wait a table, you'll receive a cryptic hand signal from the girl, which uh -huh. tells you what the customer desires. And if you want to please them, you better remember all of them. What the fuck what? are you trying to What's say? What's happening? I, I don't know. I'll be back with a gun. Sus. And just in I'm case this goodness. wasn't painful, every time you go to a new table, the game will throw a fucking flashbang. So over the course of a never-ending grind, I need to play I was this. given the most painful migraine I will ever get in my life. This, this is wild. And this music inspire my killing urges. By the way, this game is a beat 'em up. So to conclude our it. cabaret adventure, our reward is the Mad Dog style, which allows you to wield a knife and sprint <laughs> at fucking breakneck velocity, <laughs> stalking your foes like a cracked-up Doberman, and a How, you can't, you don't fight that. Up kill people. Oh fuck, that looks pretty sharp. Anyways, good luck playing with the yes. knife style. Is absolutely yes. an experience. What Max or one day might actually become a YouTuber. So when <laughs> heard that unlocking the other secret style involved eight hours of the real estate quest. I promptly had a PTSD attack. I have a fucking fish to feed. Take my advice. <laughs> <laughs> the Zero has a lot of side content. And if you happen to be a completionist, stay away. Oh, or no. you might just be locked in the Facebook game for three days. I now, will be. Excuse yeah, me. I'll 100%. be spending the rest of my day betting on domestic violence. What? That's a mini game? You know, I, when I, I love everything this about game, this. I expected brutal combat. I expected silly takedowns, but what I didn't expect was the hour I spent with the claw machine. I would hate this. I'm having a fucking blast. I don't think <laughs> I need to play cool for three hours, but they just put it in. And let me tell you, nothing sells the fictional world of Japan. Why have I not played this game? Town. So at this point, I started wondering what kind of game I was actually playing. It turns out that Yakuza Zero is a lot like reality. You always need more money, mostly yeah. for upgrades where you inject money directly into your arms and collect every vaccine. <laughs> but secondarily, healthcare never comes free. So every time you take damage, you're gonna have to consume to fill the void inside. Or alternatively, carry thousands of dollars in medicine. There is no limit to juicing. It's no exaggeration <laughs> to say that Yakuza's difficulty depends entirely on how much of a Sigma male you are. Oh Here you might not get any pussy, but Sus. he is getting paid. You might think yeah. that beating up the homeless is the way to go, but that is for babies. Ballin, if you want but to at make what the cost? Rule, though, you'll have to risk it all on gambling. What's More specifically, happening? betting on scantily clad women beating each other half to death. And because of the copyright music and interesting visuals, <laughs> putting this in my video represents me betting my real income. Majima, however, never has money problems. Because Accurate. his cabaret pays him several billion yen. The entire plot of the game happens because we're fighting over one tenth of that. So it's a yeah. shame that I lost all of it. Yes, all ten billion of it. Because I was robbed by a man with fucking orangutan strings. Oh, Mr. Shakedown. Okay. And if you encounter him, run. It doesn't run? matter how much you have. It doesn't matter how long you've spent getting it. If you lose to Mr. Shakedown, he will take all ten billion wow. of it and then disappear to somewhere. So somewhere. if you want a cent of that back, you better go find him uh, eventually. That's pretty bad. Eventually. But like all human suffering, this can become a business opportunity. You see, Mr. Shakedown I'll is have actually to do a it. form of banking. Dame Whatever Dame amount he robs base. from you, the game will add 15% more. Meaning, if you're up for the challenge of defeating Harambe, the returns <laughs> are worth it. At least with this method, your money doesn't vanish into the void. Of yeah. course, that isn't always a bad thing. There's a lot of places to spend our money, and most of them are fun. A little they too have arcade fun, games actually. I don't want to have to read the fucking phone book to play some goddamn chi-
Chinese solitaire. Tabletop simulator, never heard of it. The only game I play is Eels and Escalators. What I'm trying to say is, this is a rabbit hole. Eel, I My personal favorite was getting addicted to the bowling minigame and then oh, winning no. the chicken. Who what? as a financial advisor. Yakuza is- Wait. Hold the fuck up. Did I hear that right? ...to the bowling minigame and then winning the chicken who doubles as a financial- I have to play this. It's the perfect game. This- this is all I've needed. This- this- this is all I've needed in life, is to have a chicken as a financial advisor. I'm not even being facetious. Like, this is goddamn amazing, and I'm very upset I've not played this game now. Advisor, Yakuza is amazing. not meant to be questioned. And that <laughs> isn't even the wackiest game. That honor goes to the phone dating, which takes the form the of what? a shooter. Yes, oh, like what? Call of How? Duty. To win what? a date with the girl of our dreams, we are going to have to pick I mean the right <laughs> responses from a wide variety of options. Most of Dude, his name is same, Nugget, like no shit. a girl to fight a marsupial. Oh. For some reason, women don't like that. But the best possible outings lean heavily on this game's amazing soundtrack which features a number of beautiful karaoke themes stylish disco tracks and stellar emotional ballads nee. i'm of course talking about the karaoke and the dancing which are both incredible in their wow. style and creativity they are so out there so truthful and i got project ninja so vibes good, from that but i just couldn't get enough of it in short they're everything a dance should be this scene tells me more about majima than an entire hideo kojima script kiryu has never killed anyone but let me tell you this man knows how to murder a dance floor yeah Man is confident. He's got it. I love everything about this. I need this. I need this in my life. Isn't it on Steam now? And yet, that's not even half the fun, because Yakuza 0 contains an array of interesting, meaningful, and necessary side necessary. quests, which allow the player to engage in a variety of small stories, ranging from pizza and delivery cheap. to oh my God, I need a this phone now. battery of that one's a little boring. You can even roleplay as a Persona worth. fan by following a child man around of the ET, city. That is worth. These quests will have entirely unique fights and challenges, Menacing accompanied man. by complex moral judgment and logic puzzles. In one instance, logic I was given puzzle, the task what? of infiltrating the cult of Munan Cho Hepto Oh, I had to learn the practice. Oh, oh, I know who that is. That was the occult. That was the cult leader of the sarin gas attacks. Oh no, I know exactly who the fuck that was. Ooh. Ooh, 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 yeah, that's not bueno. This ...of Shura PP, the acquisition of Kulipas, and the greeting of Munancho. Based on him? Point, oh my god. the game god. tested me on their exact definitions. I promptly beat their leader to death. <laughs> In another instance, <laughs> Kirby teams up with the famous movie director, Steven Spinning, known for his hit film, <laughs> Indian Jeans, to complete a music video with famous international pop star, Miracle Johnson. Nah, fuck that, dude. I was hired to beat the extras to death. Now that I think about it... Don't use sarin gas on innocent people. The hospital, ...except for the pizza one. That ends in love. It's pizza. not delivery. Oh. It's too short. No. This oh, stands man, in stark contrast pizza. I want to the pizza actual now. plot of the game, which is played completely straight. Taking everything I've said before into account, I you love might this. think this is weird, Nugget. and sometimes it is. One day, <laughs> you might be saving a helpless blind woman, and the next, abandoning her so you can play Idolmaster for several days. Amazing. I'm sure that she'll be just fine. But funny anecdotes aside, there is an abundance of real drama and emotion here. Of all the things I expected this game to be, sad was not one of them. Neither did I expect a believable love story or the murder mystery. This game is downright determined to constantly surprise you, ah. even if it has to stop making sense. In Majima's story, we are sent to kill a buff Chinese man before what? fighting him, teaming up with him to <laughs> save the innocent, and then fighting him again, but I changed my mind. This exact arc happens with three separate characters, wow. and that's just Majima's story. In wow. fact, despite the game being called Yakuza Zero, <laughs> Kiyu leaves the family in Chapter 1. Oh. Then he fucking rejoins it. Oh. Every antagonist has so much goddamn personality that you just don't know when you're gonna be friends with them. Every man is vying for I power need this. and control, but each does I it need for this. their own distinct reasons. A one the writing in this looks amazing. Who only desires money and women. Kuze is a boxer who wants to fight a lot. Shibusawa is obsessed with power, and Nishitani is the Joker. Enemies become friends, friends become enemies, and Kuze will not leave me alone. The only character who's actually not interesting is essentially Chinese Spider-Man. <laughs> How? How do you make that uninteresting? 
Holy shit. Bro. Whose defining feature is that he's ugly. Unless you play the Chinese version of the game. <laughs> then he's weirdly handsome and also on the cover. But even when playing in the Whoa. most serious of circumstances, the game still catches you off guard. Oh a tense God. deal with a Yakuza boss can change seemingly at random into a ridiculous combat encounter fighting 90 enraged apes. Or in the case of Majima, a visit to the CIA becoming a fever dream in which you have to fight the buff cross-dressers. Oh. The game cares more about good gameplay and fun story than actually making sense. It's quite refreshing. It is, that sounds quite serious, refreshing. It really means something. And Side story's dumb silly, bullshit. It's, it's right up my alley. Cathartic. Everything has impact, unless it's a gun. We haven't killed anyone, by the way. All in all, wow. Yakuza really? is more true to life than any other game I've ever played. Not by making sense or being realistic, but emotionally. At the beginning of this game, Kiryu is just kind of a cool buff guy. But after exploring his friendships, seeing him have fun, and just interacting with people, I realized that this is much more. So when things take a bad turn and we're at our lowest point, you really feel it. More yeah. than almost any other game. Yakuza is about life, with all the beautiful ecstasy, awful tragedy, and everything in between. Fights are never just fun in Yakuza. They can be comedic, cathartic, or just really goddamn cool. They're mixed of emotions. This writing like has to be top And every cutscene is filled with emotion and personality. When I first played, I thought that Yakuza was all over the place, that it was somehow messy. But now I realize that life is fucking messy. Fair. And that's okay. Yeah. I want to thank all of the Yakuza bosses who are using my channel to launder money, yeah. kind of like a pizza joint in New York City. <laughs> if you want to contribute towards the channel and facilitate wow. questionable activities, then I recommend taking a look at my Patreon down below. Thank Saucy all of you Max for Sword. watching Ooh. and waiting, and of course, don't try to escape. Dame, dame. <laughs> dame, yo. <laughs> I love this. I need to play this. Oh my god. I need this in my life, chat. I, I have to.